Commercial lending is a vital component of real estate investing. However, understanding the metrics you use to evaluate commercial loans can be challenging. Three key metrics that lenders use to evaluate commercial loans are loan to value, debt service coverage ratio, uh, and debt yield. First off, loan to value is the ratio of the loan amount to the value of the property. LTV is an essential metric for lenders since it helps them determine the amount of risk they are taking on by lending money. Most lenders require a maximum LTV of 75 to 80% for commercial loans, and a higher LTV means the borrower is putting less equity into the property, which makes the loan a little bit riskier for the lender. For example, if a borrower wants to purchase a commercial property worth a million dollars and has a lender maximum LTV of 80%, then in that case, the maximum loan would be uh, $800,000. Uh, the second metric is DSCR, or debt service coverage ratio, and that's the ratio of the property's net operating income to the annual debt payments. So DSCR measures the property's ability to generate enough cash flow to cover its debt obligations. Lenders typically require a minimum DSCR of 1.25 to 1.35 for commercial loans. A higher DSCR means the property is generating more cash flow to cover its debt obligations, which decreases the risk for the lender. For example, suppose a commercial property has a net operating income of $100,000 per year, and the annual debt payments are $75,000 a year. In that case, the DSCR is 1.33, which would meet the lender's minimum requirement of 1.25. Uh, the third metric is debt yield. It's the ratio of the property's net operating income to the loan amount. So debt yield measures the property's ability to generate enough cash flow to cover the loan amount. Lenders typically require a minimum debt yield of 8 to 12% for commercial loans. A higher debt yield means the property is generating more cash flow to cover the loan amount, which decreases the risk for the lender. For example, suppose a commercial property has a net operating income of $100,000 per year and a loan amount of $800,000. In that case, the yield is 12.5% which means the lender's minimum requirement of 8% is met. In conclusion, understanding the metrics used to evaluate commercial loans is essential for real estate investors looking to secure financing. LTV, DSCR, and debt yield are three critical metrics that lenders use to evaluate commercial loans. By understanding these metrics and their minimum requirements, real estate investors can better position themselves to secure commercial financing. Now, if you're in need of an experienced commercial real estate broker, I can be reached at 281-222-0433, or you can visit here to schedule a consultation. Calendly.com slash Viking Enterprise. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Appreciate your time and hope you have a good day.